Man, that's like right in their like bladder too. It's not even really like a stomach stab, it's like a bladder stab. Ooh, is he about to get fancy on us? Oof, gonna have to kick some mushrooms after this. No more blocking! <laughs> you block, I kick! Oh no! I've got body fall down syndrome. Ooh. Up and over. Uh. <laughs> Pardon us for our technical difficulties. The fight concluded and Dojima was stabbed. We then went on to the next section where, Do where Don comes in and offers his help. To which point, he begins to literally dance on their faces. And is actually pretty awesome. Uh... He also apparently has a bird. Oof. Ugh, this prick. All those who'd stand against the government must die. That was a final blow. <laughs> we don't need you anymore. So it appears that even those who stand with the government will also be killed. None are safe. The technical difficulties will persist for just a little while longer. The audio fixes before the visual does, so... Please bear with us! <laughs> so basically this guy is just like, you'll never defeat the government! And the other guy is just like, on the floor and he's like... Uh. Oh no, sorry, this is the audio from the visual that we just recently saw. Ooh, why me? No. Now it's your turn. So, Dojima got injured because we stayed. So I think Don can take care of himself. So I think the hero made the right decision. Even though Don is really fun to watch fight. <laughs> he didn't see anything. I am the knight. Man. Purple. Purple Cloak's uh, little hint tip was like really, really helpful for this timeline. <laughs> Is that Tokugawa? Why? Why is that necessary? Like, what did she do? She stayed in town, and because she stayed in town, she has to get drawn and quartered? Well, drawn and halved? Very toned down version. 
<laughs> oh. And yes, after completing this run, I did remember that um, the awesome dude with the Yakuza sleeves was lying in the ditch over there in the in the um, in the distance. And if you talk to him, then you get a better ending than what we get. But retrospect, you know. Hindsight 2020, blah blah blah. Whoa, these guys are huge. They make the swords in their hands look like knives. Uh, like, I know it's not in the game's programming, but logically, you should take care of the ropes that are attached to the cows first. God, these guys are like meat bags. They just have so much HP. <laughs> Come over here. I'll knock that silly hat off of your big meat face. Ah, oh, yeah. Final showdown music. Let's go. Yeah, you get ultimate block. Whoa, he's getting fancy. Don't let him get fancy on you. Ooh, get a little up and over. Whoa. Yeah, no getting fancy in here. All of these guys look like they belong in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. But then again, that character, that big dude character design is actually really common in a lot of Japanese. Uh, like anime manga depictions. Ooh. Oh, I thought he was gonna get the other guy too. <laughs> Look at that guy over there. He's just like, mmm. While all of his men are dying, he's just like, mmm. I wonder what I'll have for dinner tonight. Maybe I'll order out? Get some of that Spanish meal. Oh, come on, don't let don't let this big goon style on you. Come on, get him. Stab him, lift him up and over. Ooh, he was about to he was about to go all fancy. Just stab him in the crotch and throw him away. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> and ooh. God. It's like magic. So far, the hero hasn't talked, like, at all during this entire thing. Using your own outdated ways. I don't know, man. If you don't have a lot of practice with it, stick to your own ways. <laughs> Get out of the corner, man. <laughs> oh, 
Yep. No, no, no. Where's, where's Tamagawa? There you are. Okay. No, no, no. Where's Tamagawa? There you are. I've put you at great risk. I, I, there they are! Get them! Wait, look at that! It can't be true! Commander Tamagawa, our greatest leader, is someone please dispatch a messenger to the main force! Let's escape while they're confused. Later. The government army made a surprise attack on the Ro uh, Rokotsu Pass and succeeded in bringing the Kudo family of the Akadama clan under its control. Rokotsu Pass and the surrounding area fell into the heads of the Meiji government, hands of the Meiji government. However, despite its overwhelming victory, the commander of the government army was re reported to have been killed in this battle. History does not record the name of the samurai who killed the commander with nothing but a sword. And there you have it, just one of six, I think, endings. I would argue that there are more than six, but the other variations just have like minor things like how much of a dick you were, or how nice you were, even though you got a, a subjectively bad ending. Also, which sword did you fight with and stuff like that? So we are, so for this thing, I feel like the hero had a very conservative sword, whereas like, let's say, um, the first guy that we fought with the Yakuza sleeves, he had a very, uh, liberal sword with movement and such. And combinations. So yeah, um, I hope to wrangle up someone else to kind of sit beside and I would love to go through some of the other endings um, especially the number one ending which I have to concentrate a lot more on and um, I take that one a lot more seriously because it it's not I wouldn't say it's like perfectly written but it is it is well written it's definitely better it's definitely better it's more well thought out than some of the other storylines in uh, this game. So this was the most simple and the easiest timeline to kind of just run through. And yeah, I hope it was was enjoyable. Um. I'm going to get some water, and then I will take a nap. Thanks for playing! Ending number three! So yeah, if I had saved that guy with the tattoo on his head, um, everyone else would have come in, I think, and I would have gotten ending number two? This would have been a perfect ending if only everyone had survived. All right.